After recording the last video and talking about this Yi 1080p home camera and how um, I uh, retired it and replaced it with another camera, I remembered that this camera actually retired another camera. This one. Looks the same. It's not though. This one here is the 780, uh, 720p version of the other one. Uh, and it's the first E camera I actually purchased. So, I thought, quick video, let's see what's inside this one. Is it any different? Let's find out. So, fortunately, I know which screwdriver I need because it looks like the screws are exactly the same, which is nice. Oh, that screw almost fell. Oh, okay. Yeah, from the outside, um, honestly, uh, the only way you can tell the difference between these two cameras, aside from the label on the back, which with the uh, newer one actually mentions is a 1080p camera. Well, this one doesn't mention any specific resolution, but I know it is 720p. Uh, they work with the same app, by the way, so, you know. But the only other way you can tell the difference between them is the, as I mentioned prior, the 1080p camera has a convex front element on its lens. Well, this one has the more traditional con, sorry, concave, convex. Got those confused. All right, enough of that. Let's see inside. Wow. Um. Might try to do side by side later. I don't know. Take a screen grab of the first video, but honestly, that looks exactly the same. Um, wonder if the SOC is any different. No, I'm pretty sure that's the same. Three five one eight. Wow. Okay. So um, interesting. Pretty much the same. Let's see. There's any else? Any other difference? How do you get this out of here? That's oh, the same. Um. Wow. Yeah. Identical. All right. So, um, what I'm going to do is I'll link to uh, I'll, I'll capture another video of the difference in video quality between these two cameras. That there is a no there is a noticeable difference. But aside from that, um, build quality is the same. The housing is a little more tran transparent. That's interesting. But aside from that, they're the same camera. So, aside from the sensor, that's in the lens. It's interesting. I do notice that this one has a slightly wider um, frame of view uh, than the newer one, but it's not much difference. I think the newer one's spec at 111 degrees uh, field of view. I, I don't know what this one is, but it's probably similar. Hotbox uh, solenoid. A uh, hot mirror solenoid. All right. Well, that's all I got. Maybe that was interesting. If you see these guys on sale, they're they're the older version. I don't see them very much, but if you see them on sale, you know, grab grab a couple. The same hack that uh, I used for the 1080p to enable RTSP uh, is available for some of these. You have to be careful which one you get. Um, but this one was available, so I also hacked this one, so. I can use it with my Zone Minder system as well. Alright, thanks for watching. Till next time.